Hi folks, it's Jody with Strength and Wisdom Tarot. Here to do a random reading for the 8th of January. As you all know, these are general readings. If they resonate with you, that's great. And if they don't, maybe next time. And thank you for everyone who has liked, subscribed, shared to my channel. You guys rock! And all the information for personal readings, life path readings, uh, mystery healing boxes, mystery healing starting uh, kit boxes are in the description box below. Let's see. And just to remind you that I am going live tomorrow at 7 o'clock Eastern Standard Time. Want to come join me? <laughs> okay, let's see what's cracking lacking. We have the Libra card of justice. Could be something in a court system. Let me get that off my screen. It could be karmic justice. Something's getting rectified, justified. Something's being made fair. Something's being balanced out again. Okay. So it is, is it in the court system or is this karma? Oh, as soon as I said karma. Hmm. We have the Six of Swords here in the reverse, in the upright. This is moving away to common waters, leaving a situation behind. In the reverse, somebody's not leaving. Could be a water sign or a water-like person, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. When she's in the upright, she's got even keel emotion. She's not coming unraveled, turning into a puddle. And she's very, very intuitive. She could be sentimental. Hmm. What am I thinking? This might be a divorce. Somebody's not leaving a situation behind. Somebody's not going to let something go until something does get rectified or justified with a water like person. Hmm. Could be a discord. Now we have the Gemini card of the lovers in reverse. And this is that soulmate connection and I get you card. You know, a bond like the weather. It's also about life-changing decisions. And in the reverse, either this is a splitting of two soulmates or a life-changing decision that's not being made. Somebody refuses to leave a situation behind or now this could be a friendship, partnership, you know, love ship, career ship. Maybe the other person wants to leave and she still thinks, King, Queen, don't matter today, that it could be fixed or something needs to be fixed. Yeah, because it's the world card in reverse. It's a cycle not ending. Now, maybe this cycle should have end, needs to end, and that could be, you know, the justice here. Somebody be fair to themselves. Don't let something go further than it has to go, especially if there's no connection anymore. If something wants to wrap itself up and somebody just either refuses to believe it's over or coming to an end. Hmm. Well, get the five of cups. Here's the would the could the should remorse, regret, sorrow, right under the justice card. It's the all hope is not lost yet because if this person turns around, it's what you have and what instead of the have nots. And there's two full cups here. Somebody's too woe down with emotions. Maybe to see that something is or needs to end. I'm hearing in my head that this no way to live. This is no way to live. Hmm. It's a marriage. You get the four of wands now. Stability, something going to a higher level. Somebody won't leave a marriage. Somebody doesn't see anybody else on the horizon. And that's right under the Queen of Cups. Somebody doesn't have eyes for someone else. She's going to stick it out to the end. Regardless. I'm thinking that she thinks that he, she, 
Doesn't matter if it's an energy. That something can be fixed. Something's not coming to an end. And then maybe somebody has remorse and regret, you know, because they don't see it. They won't acknowledge it. They won't accept it. Hmm. Because somebody's made their mind up. They're not juggling, maybe two people. But, you know, this is, you know, should I, shouldn't I, will I, won't I? This person's made a decision. And if it was two people... This person, this water-like person, didn't get picked. But refuses to believe that something's over. Hmm. Not taking any action. Under the world card, get the page of wands in reverse. Not in the upright, this would be a message to move on something, to get the ball rolling. Put something in action. Somebody's not going in that direction. And that way, something doesn't end. This could have been a split up. And maybe somebody wants a divorce with the justice card. And somebody won't let them have a divorce. Because they still want them in their lives. Hmm. Got the high priestess in the bottom. Secrets coming out. Inner knowing. So I'm kind of feeling up, feeling that vibe that, you know, somebody had a decision to make, possibly, you know, about somebody new or leaving a marriage. They decide to leave and somebody's just refusing to believe that they're gone. Let's get into this, folks. We have something that wants to be rectified and justified. Somebody here is not leaving a situation behind. It could be a water-like person, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, or somebody has these properties. This person is very intuitive. And right now has their emotions in keel. But she's got her back turned towards a separating of possibly a soulmate. And because she, there's no recognition or she's not recognizing this, he or she, that something won't end. A, a cycle won't come to complete. Somebody's in their feels. They have remorse. They have regret. They have sorrow. And it could have been about marriage. It could have been about a partnership, you know, that um, may be destined for marriage or building, you know, something together. But somebody... Did not see a future in it anymore. Didn't see it going anywhere. Someone, one person did, one person didn't. And now they're not juggling anymore. Maybe before it was a decision or a partnership, friendship. Who stays in and who stays out? A decision was made. And because a decision was made, a soulmate was lost or looked over. And this person re refuses to make a course of action to it. This, this way, the cycle keeps going. She might be giving herself, he or she, I keep saying she. She might be giving herself false hope, but something comes out. A secret comes out. Either something internally, because it's about intuition as well, that tells her, you know, to open her eyes. And I think that's what it is. I don't think it's any other secrets here that, it, that pertains to anything. I think somebody's holding on. When somebody's already let go. Whew. Okay, so let's break this down, folks. We have somebody that has a lot of would-haves, could-haves, should-haves, remorse and regret, some sorrow, about something that had to be rectified and justified. Something had to be evened out. And it could be that's a marriage or a partnership. The one person refuses to leave, but somebody already did. Could be a Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, or a water-like person that didn't see this going anywhere. Either this is the person that made the decision, or this is the person 
that refuse to believe something's over because somebody felt that somebody was a soulmate and somebody made the decision whether they're juggling two people or pro and conning they chose to leave it and because somebody here is holding on they won't take that course of action to heal from it or try to move on a cycle keeps repeating over and over This person also could be waiting, waiting for someone to come back. But something was revealed. And it just could be her intuition talking to her that maybe she really listens to it this time and goes on with her life. I really do feel that someone here is waiting and not enjoying life. Wow. So that is what I have for you. Please keep on liking, subscribing, sharing to my channel, and don't forget about tomorrow, 7 o'clock Eastern Standard Time, I'll be live, and hopefully you'll be able to join me. So till then, take care.